enough to send us a kit to test. Um, you recall from the last time out, um, I did a test sort of similar to today um, where we, I was utilizing the cool mitt in between my intervals to uh, get ready for the next interval where I could push. And uh, today, we're, instead of using a single mitt like I did the last time, we're going to use two and I'm going to wait and use them at the end of my four intervals, as you can see that we have here from Trainer Road. And uh, I'm going to do that to see how fast uh, the cool mitt may get my RPE down and additionally uh, potentially bring my heart rate down to a baseline level of around high 130s, somewhere in that neighborhood. Test conditions are exactly the same. We have a fan setting on one. Um, we're also utilizing the core app, uh, core body temperature app, which I have strapped to my side. Um, Watt bike, trainer road, and the app's up in front of me. I even ate the same thing for dinner last night. Had about the same sleep. And, uh, and the dogs are back um, helping us out with the test today. Yeah, that's about it. So I'll be checking in with you probably as we go through the intervals and definitely checking in with you when I have both mitts on at my recovery point, which should be at about 45 minute mark. So yeah, another banger today. We'll see how I do. Two intervals into it, about 30 minutes. Intervals are hard because my recovery intervals are only two minutes and the work intervals are four. Definitely a harder, more intense workout than I did last time I saw you guys. But uh, we're hanging in there. Check in with you in about 20 minutes, 10 minutes, 10 minutes. Something like that. Okay, I finished the last interval. Up 193 beats per minute. Body temp is 101.7. I expect it to continue to climb. The mitts are going on. Here we go. Check back in with you. Five minutes and see where we're at. It feels good. We're at two, almost two minutes into the recovery. My heart rate's come down quite a bit. My temperature is still rising a little bit, but that's not surprising. But, uh, from a RPE standpoint, this feels great. I'll tell you that. I was at least at a nine when I finished that last interval. Right now, I feel like I'm at about a 
five, maybe a four. seconds left in the recovery interval. Can't see it because I'm talking. My heart rate just jumped up, but it actually returned to baseline for my first block warm-up at 137. What's interesting is my body temp according to Korak has gone up since I put these on. That could be post-exercise internal temperature. It could be any number of things, but I'm starting to think Based on the last time we did this test, and I used the coolant in between the intervals, maybe the body's reaction to the net, even though it lowers your RPE, is to heat up. Because if you remember from the last test, I had a temperature threshold of over 103 degrees Fahrenheit, which I've never hit before. <laughs> um, but. I certainly think from an RPE standpoint, and from a heart rate standpoint, it is beneficial. Um, I think about 100 watts, somewhere around that neighborhood. Heart rate's 139 beats per minute. And uh, RPE is maybe a two. Um, so this is interesting information. I think, I think uh, everybody involved will in that core I'd like everybody might get something out of this. I don't know what. <laughs> the end of test number two. I definitely think there's some interesting data here. Like I said before, I don't know whether that's a physiological reaction by my body temp going up and, and, and holding while I had the mitts on, uh, but I definitely felt better um, during the recovery. I felt like I recovered way faster. Of course, that's just my perception of it, but um, yeah, there's the there's the data, and uh, I definitely think there's something here with CoolMet. Um, I know our friend Craig at Exos has been using these quite a bit, and they think very highly of them. Uh, they use them in between efforts, sets, things like that, and uh, I think there's something here. Um, can't wait to mine into the data a little bit more, but uh, thanks for watching test number two. We'll be back.